What's up guys, this is Kyle from Wax Museum. Got a quick mail day video that I wanna share with you today. As you can see, I've got stuff kinda of cut open and ready to go. Haven't got a chance to look at it yet. Um, recording this one real quick before this hurricane rolls in. By the time this is published, it will have already come through, but wanted to get some of this stuff out of the way before stuff gets hairy here in Florida. Stay safe if you are in the area. Um, so anyway, here goes. You might remember a video from last week where I bought um, just a small lot on eBay and the main reason I bought it was for the Chris Mullen refractor that uh, was not in there and uh, the seller was very kind he said he simply forgot and he shipped it out to me in a plain white envelope it came safely here no penny sleeve but looks pretty clean so that is a 97 98 tops chrome Chris Mullen refractor um, and I've seen somewhere you know both of the players in this photo um, should definitely be very green but in this case they're not so that is a win uh, everything worked out all right on that one okay so this one here is a trade that I did with um, I think Ryan is his real name green stiller is the Instagram name he's a Lamar Odom collector among other things um, we did just a real cheap um, cheap trade just regular mail no tracking and um, I traded him a numbered Lamar Odom card. And uh, there you go. There's his username, by the way. I hope I said that right. Um, he traded me this Jalen Rose refractor here. I believe this is 1999. I'm trying not to be too loud on the camera here with this. But um, so that will go nice in my refractor binder. As you can see, I'm, I'm not going out and just buying all of these refractors. I'm slowly trying to add them either via lots or via trades. Um, and that one looks great. So thanks once again, Ryan, because he didn't have to trade that to me. But I thought it would be a fun little thing to do. Cheap little trade to make. Sometimes those are fun ways to still get that mail day dopamine rush. All right, this last one here is an eBay purchase. Uh, I'm going to flip it over here. Um, you can see who the player is. It's TJ Warren. This is the new optic set, and I don't have any, I don't, at least I don't think, I don't recall owning any of the new optic cards yet. Uh, this is the optic gold of TJ Warren. Some years the optic golds look great, some years they don't. So let's do our grand reveal here. Let's get it out of this top loader so we can see the shine. A lot of gold area on this one. Some years the, the borders aren't as big. Um... I don't know. I'll have to get some out. I'll have to do a comparison video. It doesn't seem as shiny as some of the other years. Maybe it's just because there's just so much gold on that surface. But um, anyway, I'll let you guys be the judge of that. And like I said, I might have to do a comparison video later on. If you want to see that, let me know in the comments. I've done it for the other years, so it, it would just be adding this one on. Um, all right, so uh, refractor. It's one of those kind of refractor weeks, which is a great week. You know, some weeks it's more patches, but uh, those are the three cards that I got in this last week. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, there are new episodes of the audio podcast every Thursday, and thanks for watching.